Hey there, parents. Welcome to our channel where we share valuable insights and tips to help you navigate the journey of parenthood. Today, we're diving into a topic that's close to many hearts co-parenting after separation. This is a journey that many parents find themselves on, and it can be challenging but also incredibly rewarding. It's not always easy, but with the right approach, it can be done successfully for the sake of your child. The goal is to ensure that your child feels loved and supported by both parents, despite the changes in the family structure. First off, let's talk about separating your feelings from co-parenting. This is a crucial step in ensuring that your child's needs are prioritized. It's natural to have strong emotions about the separation, but it's crucial to keep those feelings in check when it comes to your child. Your child should not be burdened with the emotional weight of the separation. Focus on their needs, not your feelings towards your ex. This means putting aside any negative emotions and concentrating on what's best for your child. Avoid blaming, judging, or resenting the other parent. These negative behaviors can create a toxic environment that can affect your child's emotional well-being. Remember, the personal relationship with your ex is different from your co-parenting relationship. It's important to distinguish between the two and maintain a professional and respectful co-parenting dynamic. Next, establish clear co-parenting boundaries and expectations. This helps in creating a structured and predictable environment for your child. Sit down together and create a parenting plan that covers custody arrangements, decision-making, and communication. This plan should be detailed and cover all aspects of your child's life. Agree on consistent rules, discipline, and schedules for both households. Consistency is key in providing stability for your child. Respect each other's time with the child and don't interfere. Effective communication is key. Make sure to communicate openly and respectfully. Keep your conversations open, respectful, and focused on your child. This helps in avoiding misunderstandings and conflicts. Commit to regular discussions about your child's needs and progress. This ensures that both parents are on the same page and can address any issues promptly. Never, and I mean never, argue in front of your child or use them as a messenger. This can cause unnecessary stress and anxiety for your child. And please avoid speaking negatively about the other parent to your child. Be consistent and reliable. Your child should feel secure and loved by both parents. Your child needs stability, so ensure your parenting approach is consistent between households. This helps in creating a sense of normalcy for your child. Follow through on your commitments and be dependable. Your child should be able to rely on both parents. Show a united front when it comes to your child. This demonstrates to your child that both parents are there for them, no matter what. Now let's talk about modeling healthy behavior. Your child learns from your actions, so it's important to set a good example. Treat your ex with respect, even when you don't agree. This teaches your child the importance of respect and cooperation. Resolve conflicts maturely without involving your child. This helps in maintaining a peaceful and supportive environment for your child. Demonstrate flexibility, compromise, and cooperation. These are important skills that your child will learn from you. Let your child know it's okay to love both parents. This reassures your child that they don't have to choose sides. In conclusion, the key to successful co-parenting is prioritizing your child's well-being above your personal differences. This requires commitment and maturity from both parents. With commitment and maturity, you can create a supportive environment where your child maintains strong relationships with both parents. This is the ultimate goal of co-parenting. Thanks for watching. And remember, co-parenting like a pro is all about love, respect, and collaboration. These are the foundations of a successful co-parenting relationship. Until next time, take care. Keep prioritizing your child's happiness and well-being.